evening, folks. Welcome to the Black Fly Lounge. I'm your host, Clark Camolo, and tonight we're honored to have with us Hungry Town. We're a base out of West Towns in Vermont, though most of the year they're spent touring the country in their spiffy van. Without further ado, let's welcome Hungry Town. Hello, we are Rebecca Hall and Ken Anderson, also known as Hungry Town, and we're going to play a few songs for you tonight. Um, the, we're going to start with a song called The Rose or the Briar, which is sort of a dysfunctional love song featured on our album Hungry Town. Are you ready? What will you be tonight, my love? What will you be tonight? The rose or the briar? What will you be tonight, my love? What will you be tonight? The rose or the briar? I made her walking in the lane, her angel face so fair. But from her words did come the devil answered there what will you be tonight my love what will you be tonight the rose or the briar what will you be tonight my love what will you be tonight we're going to do, um, this is a song that we played a lot on our last tour. We were out uh, down south and going um, across the country, going out west. And um, it's a song that we actually got inspired to write while we were sitting on our porch just looking at the foliage um, one late fall. And um, we like to play it when we're away from home because it makes us feel less homesick. It's called November Song.
Jumping high, you can catch the sun. Turn the clock back when the day is done. Teach the sea to forsake the shore. Stop the young men marching on. got a new song for you next. Um, we haven't recorded this one yet. Um, this song is just sort of, it kind of has the sensibilities of a blues song, but it's not, it's not played like one. It's called Sally Lazy, and it's going to be um, on our next album, which we're going to be recording over the summer. And it's kind of a sing-along, so we, all, we welcome all of you at home to sing along. <laughs> but actually, um, we're in Manchester, and it's probably a different day, so you might have to sing really loud. Are you ready? Yes. One, two, three. Sally Lazy, let your hair hang down. Sally Lazy, let your hair hang down. Leave it trailing, trailing on the ground. Sally Lazy, let your hair hang down Worry too much, worry too hard to sleep Worry too much, worry too hard to sleep Had some friends, but none that I could keep Worry too much, worry too hard to sleep Sally Lazy, let your hair hang down. Sally Lazy, let your hair hang down. Leave it trailing, trailing on the ground. Oh, Sally Lazy, let your hair hang down. Walk with me, oh, walk with me. Walk with me, oh, walk with me, oh, oh. I've been traveling such a lonely mile. Walk with me, oh, walk with me, oh, oh. Sally Lazy, let your hair hang down. Sally Lazy, let your hair hang down. Leave it trailing, trailing on the ground. Oh, Sally Lazy, let your hair hang down. Keep on moving or you fall out of time. Keep on moving or you fall out of time. Got no rhythm running out of rhyme. Keep on moving or you fall out of time Sally Lazy, let your hair hang down Sally Lazy, let your hair hang down Leave it trailing, trailing on the ground Oh, Sally Lazy, let your hair hang down
got no money, nowhere to lay my head. So I'm gonna make you smile instead. Sally Lazy, let your hair hang down. 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 Well, I hope you enjoyed that first set with Hungry Town as much as I did. I'm here with Ken and Rebecca. We're just going to find out what they're doing, where they're going, where they've been. Uh, I get their emails, uh, the dumpster blog, so I feel like I'm in touch with them all the time. But let's uh, let them tell you. Well, we just got back from a 13,000-mile tour of the southern United States. Smart. Uh, Yes, we, <laughs> we try to uh, avoid um, shoveling snow in Vermont during the months of January, February, and March. So uh, we went down to Florida and then across uh, the southern states to California and then all the way back and got home on April 1st. And so what kind of gigs were you doing? Uh, some folky festivals? And we were doing a little of everything, a lot of listening rooms. We play a lot of libraries, folk coffee houses, house concerts. Anywhere the house. Abandoned parking lots, <laughs> rooftops, right. playing for gas, <laughs> gas stations. Mm -hmm. Yes, our um, and our monthly bl blog is actually a newsletter called the News Dumpster, which is fabulous. You can, and I feel like I'm, I haven't. It feels like you haven't been away. So we first met uh, doing a benefit concert six years ago for the tsunami victims, and which was tremendous. We raised a ton of money, and it's the first time I met Ken and Rebecca, and have been a fan of theirs ever since. Let's talk about your CDs. Okay. There they are. Lean down in front. Let's <laughs> let's look at them. Um, well, this is uh, the first one. It's this, um, it's called Rebecca Hall sings. It was recorded in about 2000. 2000. Uh, this is Rebecca Hall's Sunday Afternoon. Uh, and this is our most recent, which is called Hungry Town. As you can see, we no longer go by the name Rebecca Hall on account of... <laughs> There's two of us. On account of me, <laughs> Ken Anderson. But um, this is our latest, and we have another CD probably coming out um, in late 2010. Where, where are you putting that together? Where? Yeah. Um, at the infamous... Soundcatcher Recording Studios in West Townsend, Vermont. Excellent. Which also happens to be our house. Which happens to be our upstairs bedroom <laughs> yeah. with six foot ceilings. So where are you off to uh, after mud season here in Vermont? Um, well, we're off to the UK and um, England, Scotland, and a tiny bit of the Netherlands. Fabulous. Provided the volcano doesn't erupt again. Yeah, yes, yes, yes. But. And um, what other projects? I know that you guys get involved with some other people and you do yeah, a lot of collaborations. Been, uh, our little studio is, uh, we just finished um, uh, a project by Gene Morrison, who is a Jamaica-based singer-songwriter. Um, his first album, which I think has been a yeah. great success. Yeah. Um, and, uh, and, that's what we, and we're doing some other projects as well. We hope to do more. Excellent. Thanks. So uh, for your second set, you got anything special for us? I know they're all special. That's a really dumb question. We're, we're doing um, a couple of new songs. We're going to start off with an a cappella number. So. Oh, great. Probably a lot of people out there haven't heard that one yet. Hungry Town. Go out and see them. They're great. I love them. Thanks, you guys. We love, we love you. Yes. <laughs> and we love you. Thanks for coming. <laughs> Hi, remember us? We are Hungry Town. We're going to start this set with uh, another brand new song. This one um, was inspired by an Arctic wildflower called the Blue Star, which only blooms um, one day a year on the brightest day of the summer, and then it's gone forever. So it's just sort of the song is about appreciating some things because they may be fleeting, appreciating them while they're there. Um, it's called The Sweetest Flower I Ever Saw. 
the sweetest flower I ever saw grows on the westward plain. The only boy I ever loved I never may see again. The blue star blooms but once a year when the sun shines bright in the sky. But if you pluck those flowers out, then they will surely die. And if you tell the one you love that you'll be no man's bride, he'll leave you sure as the sun will rise, as sure as the tears you'll cry. The flowers in my garden grow and bloom from spring to fall. But wildflowers grow just where they will and need no care at all. The sweetest flower I ever saw grows on the westward plain. The only boy I ever loved, I never may see again. How's it going? Um, <clears throat> about. Uh, about six, six and a half years ago, we moved from New York City to the wilds of Vermont. Um, and for us, it was kind of a big deal because we lived right in downtown Manhattan. And now we live uh, on a little tiny road up in the country. Um, we, there was going to be no small town or small city for us. It was going to be either the middle of the city or the middle of nowhere. And uh, why this was a big deal was because I'd only lived in apartments my whole life. Uh, and Rebecca, pretty much the same. Uh, now, in an apartment, you don't have to think about where the hot water comes from. You just look at the tap with an H on it, and that's all you need to know. Um, if you go away for a long time, it's perfectly okay. When you come back, it'll be pretty much as you left it. But as many of you know who live in houses, especially up around here, um, it's not so simple, is it? Um, you go away for a while, and the roof starts to leak, and the paint starts to peel, uh, and things just become a mess unless you take care of that house. Uh, and that was a new thing. So we got to thinking, after we learned a few handy skills, that isn't it really true of people, too, that if you neglect someone uh, or if you feel neglected, uh, you start to fall, that person will start to fall apart just like that house. And um, we kind of put those two ideas uh, into a song. It's a new one, and it's called Any Forgotten Thing.
Some things here can still be fixed For others it's too late But I can't be sure of what to keep And what to throw away It's like living in the space between The winter and the spring One season of uncertainty For every forgotten thing We're going to play a song that we wrote um, right before we ended up moving to Vermont. Ken and I um, originally met and got married in New York City. And though we enjoyed our life there for many years, the last couple of years that we were living there, we were spending more and more time getting into our car and driving up north into New England. And um, one of our favorite things to do on those trips was to find the little highways that run alongside the path of the river. And there's a lot of those in Vermont. And try not to drive into the river. If possible. Um, and that's what inspired this next song. It's called Going North. Sitting around dreaming on the back of the sun I left you for dead Now I get nothing done Oh, the moon spills its light on the water outside And if you were here We could go for a ride On the highway that curls Round her sister the river And I think I'd like to go north Please won't you buy me a house by the sea I could work at the diner, we would live easily And we'd fasten our shutters against winter storms With the waves crashing round us, we'd sleep safe and warm And in the summers we'd sit and smile at the tourists and visit the beaches at night. La da 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 la da 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 la da 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 la da 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 la da 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 la da 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 la da 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 la da 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 Highway she curls round her sister the river, and I think I'd like to go north. so much for tuning in tonight. We've got one more song for you. Um, this is actually a song that was written right around this time um, a few years ago. And this time meaning spring. Yes, this time meaning spring. Um, late April. For all you rerun fans. Right. <laughs> um, and uh, this was a song that we wrote after enduring our first Vermont winter which lasted about six months longer than we thought was really necessary to get the job done. And um, we were really ready for spring to come by the time we wrote this song. The song is called Lucille, Lucille. And the Lucille in the song is kind of like Lady Luck. And the singer is imploring her to make spring come and other good things happen. So, Like money to fall out of the sky. Yeah, that would be good. Thank you. 
Once again, we are Hungry Town. Please visit our website at hungrytown.net. And we have CDs for sale. <laughs> and um, if you visit myspace.com slash hungrytown, we have a lot of photos. And, Some um, of them very silly. If you drop by our place, um, we'd be happy to say hi. I don't know what I'm talking about. OK, here we All go. All right, Lucille, Lucille. <laughs> Great set from Hungry Town. They are definitely one of my favorite duos. I hope you all get a chance to get out and see them live sometime. Uh, I want to thank our sponsors, Manchester Bar and Grill. They gave us some fabulous lasagna tonight. And, uh, and now, without further ado, our house band, Beyond Further, with Love Is Power. Hey, uh, we're at Beyond Further. This is a song off of our. CD that we, we recorded back in 2006, and uh, it has a little bit to do with the Iraq War, which is kind of old history, but anyway, uh, we hope you like it. Ready? <laughs> And tell the children the truth today Take everything you want and give it away It'll come back to you in a better way You know, you know, love is power Love is power Love is power Love is power
take a big chance, give a thousand dollar bill to every family in Iraq. Kill the enemy with kindness. Can you see the world like that? You know, you know, love is power. Love is power. Love is power. Love is power. Love is power.